Well, yesterday, a three-year-old boy was found dead in his father's car outside a Kalamazoo area grocery store. And according to the Kalamazoo County Sheriff's Office, his death was likely caused by prolonged heat exhaustion. Tessa Cash Crush is here for you now with more on hot car deaths and how people can prevent this from happening. Yes, Sherry, this death over in Vicksburg is the 20th hot car death in the U.S. this year. That's according to the nonprofit Kids in Car Safety. And the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration said this happens about 40 times a year. That's about one child every 10 days. Yesterday in Vicksburg, caution tape lined the parking lot of a grocery store, and the small community grieved over the loss of a toddler. Amber Rollins, the director of Kids in Car Safety, said it's common for people to think that this can only happen to neglectful parents or caregivers. And nothing could be further from the truth. She said the majority of these cases is when an otherwise loving and responsible person simply forgets. This is one of those things that just no one thinks can happen to them until it does. Rollins reflected on a time when her autopilot took over and she forgot her child in the backseat of her car. You know, it was in that moment that it really hit me in a different way that this can happen to anybody. It's important to note you should never leave your child in the car, no matter the temperature. It's a mild summer, but it's a common misconception that things like this only happen during a heat wave. You know, it does not have to be 80 or 90 degrees outside for this to happen. She said that's because the vehicle acts like a greenhouse, trapping the heat in. And when you combine that with the fact that a child's body temperature rises three to five times faster than an adult, you got a recipe for disaster in literally minutes. It can take just 10 minutes for a child's body to reach 104 degrees, causing heat stroke, which becomes fatal at 107 degrees. Roland suggests keeping a reminder item, such as a stuffed animal that sits on your lap when your child is in the car to avoid disaster. You think this can never happen to you, but I can assure you that it can. It can happen to anybody. In similar hot car deaths in recent years, parents who forgot their children have been rarely charged with crimes, though it is unclear if the father will be prosecuted. The Kalamazoo County Sheriff's Office and Vicksburg's Police Department are still investigating the incident. If you see a child in a car that appears to be in distress or unresponsive, get them out immediately by any means necessary and call 911. Back to you.